Hey, this is Nelson with the E-Riders channel. Today we're going to be reviewing a pretty cool fat tire foldable e-bike, the Rattan LF. Let's check it out. All right, so when you go to the Rattan website and look up the Rattan LF, 750-watt step-through foldable fat tire e-bike, You'll see a lot of other e-bikes in different colors, but this one specifically being red is just a little, I think it's like $100 more at the, at the current moment. Um, they also have another color, uh, purple, which looks like it's out of stock right now. So right now it is going for $1,299, but it looks like they have a payment plan or installment plan with PayPal. So if you're a PayPal fan, uh, go ahead and definitely take advantage of that. So let's go ahead and look at the other models I was just talking about. All right, so here are the other models, the step over and some step throughs. Now, of course, you just saw the red one, which is down below, uh, which is also where the purple color would be. And that is at a regular price of $12.99. Of course, the ones above are a little cheaper. So if you have a favorite color, uh, it's uh, on the top row, you might save yourself a little bit of cash. Now, let's go ahead and check out the uh, Britan LF step through foldable e-bike and the specs all right starting off you got a 750 watt motor with 960 watts of peak power you also have a removable 48 volt 13 amp battery and here's a little thing lever you just you have to remove the seat and you just pull the battery out so you can charge it independently and you also have tetro mechanical disc brakes And those brakes come with 180 millimeter disc rotors. Don't forget, this bike also has front suspension with lockout and preload options. The bike also has 20 by 4 inch CST puncture resistant tires. Really nice for going off road. In the back, you have an integrated tail light. And we also have a very hefty welded on rear rack. It's not bolted on or screwed on. It's actually welded. And on top of that, we have a nice padded seat for rear passengers. And on front and back, there are also plastic fenders. Also has a Shimano Turney TZ derailleur and seven speed Shimano gears. It also has a double chain guard to help prevent your chain falling off. And it has a suspension seat post, very rare. Since the back doesn't have rear suspension, you do have some suspension in the seat, so it'll give you a little bit of cushion in the back. Now you do have an adjustable quick release seat post too. And underneath the seat post at the very bottom is the adjustable suspension tension. Now just looking at the bike, other than the color, which is a beautiful red color, um, this, this bike and its step-through feature is really nice to get on and get off. You don't have to swing your leg all the way over the back. And it comes with a very comfortable stock seat. Almost, it almost feels oversized. And it also has a 52-tooth crank set. Now it also has a integrated front headlight, just like the tail light, and a really interesting neoprene cover for the wires. Now it has rattan brake levers, a half twist throttle, rubber grips, seven speed thumb shifter. Yeah, this neoprene cable keeper, if you will, um, is pretty long, almost the whole length uh, up the post, the handlebar post, and it's removable. Down below you, you have a couple of uh, 
holes here, which you might be able to attach certain accessories, maybe a basket of some sort. All right, now let's talk about how to fold the bike. You can start off many different ways. Whether you want to fold the middle or the handlebars. Um, but there's also another thing that no one really thinks about is let's remove the battery to make it lighter. And then how about also the pedals? Yep, the pedals do fold inward. To save every little inch of room and space. Next is the handlebar post. You flip down the lever and the post folds downward. And then you take this little little latch, pull that up, and it unlocks the bigger latch. And the bike can fold up in half with the hinge on the other side. Now this is great for for RV campers, clo you know, closets, trunks, you know, SUV in the back, you know, there's these almost fit into little tubs. So that's it. That's the Rattan LF 750 watt foldable e-bike. So then we took it on a ride and took it down the, the paths, uh, some flat paths and roads and hills, and we even took it on some grassy uh, terrain as well lots of bumps we got it dirty it got wet and we had a lot of fun uh, this bike definitely held up to uh, the rigorous test that we put it through uphill and the off-road terrains uh, if you're looking for a foldable e-bike the rattan definitely is uh, I think on the top tier of e-bikes as far as power uh, comfortability um, and size and definitely usability um, it's got a nice big screen huge numbers in, in the center e easy to navigate and it's a name brand that definitely has a very strong customer service background now I will put down in the below the, in the description you know, links to the bike um, and their website and uh, even their social media websites. So if you're interested in the Rattan, go ahead and check those out. And uh, if you like the video, please like the video and subscribe to support our channel. It helps us uh, basically keep in the, the position of ordering new cameras and and uh, even accessories so we can review those for everybody. So I will definitely see you in the next video. This is Nelson. Thanks for watching.